With more than 300 evacuation orders and over 3,000 more alerts, residents in Penticton are likely feeling the stress. And it's proven that natural disasters like wildfires can have serious impacts on one's mental health. Will you have to flee your home for how long? And on top of that, this year, trying to navigate a natural disaster with a global pandemic. And so we turned to Dr. Courtney Howard to find out how people can manage their stress and anxiety in this situation. Some of these things are very practical. So if you think about, you know, small children when they're having more trouble coping, you know, as a mom, I always kind of went through a list, you know, have you had enough sleep? Have you had enough food? Are you physically comfortable? Taking care of people's actual just physical bodies can make a big difference because there's probably a lot of people who haven't managed to get a good sleep over the last couple of days. And sometimes if you uh, take care of yourself and make sure that that happens, it just makes it a lot easier for you to take care of other people. On top of making sure you're getting enough sleep, she adds that you should stay away from caffeine, which can elevate levels of anxiety and try and eat healthy. But she adds that the anxiety doesn't stop once you go home. Follow up to the Fort McMurray wildfires. They did a follow up at a year and a half and they did find uh, significant levels of increased anxiety, depression, PTSD. So even once the fire is out, you still need to take care of your mental health. Follow up with your family doctor when reaching out helps. Um, taking action uh, helps a lot if, if we view some of these situations as a cue, a constructive unpleasant emotion. It's not fun to feel this way, but it can be the motivator we need to do some work around mitigation and also around just preparing our communities for the wildfires of the future. Make sure that we know our evacuation plans, we've cleaned the brush up around our house so that our house is less vulnerable. All of those really practical things can also help quiet some of that sense of anxiety following an event like this.